Here I am with David Hughes, assistant head from Escort Pusali, and the amazing talent behind that drama uh, creation. He did the, he wrote the drama for the young people, and they performed it. And I think, you know, it's been the most moving um, piece of drama, reflecting the online spaces that young people inhabit, the, the issues, the importance of it to them, as well as the um, challenges they face and how they need to be wise online. Um, David, tell us a little bit about the you know, going through that process of creating the drama and what it gave you, really. Yeah, well, I'd like to correct you on one thing, first of all. Yes, I, I might have been responsible for developing the content, but most but of the case. ideas, really, have come from the children and from what they've said and, and situations which are cropping up on, on a sort of week, weekly basis now in, in, yeah. in school. Oh, absolutely, um, They yeah. believe they are, are passionate about, um, obviously, digital technology. Yeah. They're also passionate about helping each other and guiding each other through. Which is lovely. Um, you know, that's, yeah. the, that's the most important thing. That's really where the inspiration came from, you know, and yeah. responding to that and making sure that in terms of developing this, the, the script or the content of the work, that I was giving them a, a vehicle yeah. that would really allow them to express their true feelings, both the, the positives and, and perhaps the, and the not consult, positive things. Did you, you know. consult them with the, the script? Yeah, yeah. I mean, we're very proud in, in Priscilla. We, we've, we, we're a school we consider to be very, very forward-thinking. Yeah. Not perhaps uh, having been in the conference for two days, uh, forward-thinking enough at the yeah. moment, but yeah. um, we are embracing change and, oh, and we are recognising the opportunities and the challenges which are linked to, to um, this developing digital age. Wonderful. And um, what's been great, and we're very, very grateful for the invitation and, and, and having been part of the conference, is having the young people here and see how they responded so positively to what's being said, you know, and they yeah. feel at last that people are listening and people are recognising yeah. that there are massive opportunities for them. Yeah. Um, Which is what we've been saying for a long time, exactly, you know, we need yeah. to strike the balance because a fear-based approach really disrespects young people. It does, it yeah. does, you know, yeah. and it, it's almost, I was just talking to somebody earlier, this is the new rock and roll for them, isn't it? You know, it and is, it's, yeah. And, it's, yeah. It's, 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 it's and every generation really, has it, isn't exactly, it? Exactly, you know, yeah. and unless we're actually there to support them and, and to embrace it and to show that yeah. they are open-minded and, and we're listening to what they're saying. And yeah. I think that's the key to moving this agenda forward, because if we don't... Yeah, we lose know, them. We are. We're, we're losing opportunities. We're going to be um, holding them back and, and in terms of allowing them to develop the skills which they totally. have you know, I, I to, couldn't to, to agree more. In this, in, in, in this world and in the future as well, you know. Yeah. They're going to go into a world of work, into yeah. jobs which haven't even been created yet. In totally. Terms of, There's um, a video that actually yeah. says that, you exactly. know, we're, we're, we're in an age where we don't know what jobs the young kids are today going and into. If, and if we don't, you know, prepare them for that. That's right. That and that challenge. means being open-minded uh, and... You know, I think uh, industry and, and all these different people have responsibilities and yeah. they need to create safer services for young people. But we need to make young people resilient. Yeah. We need to un make them understand that there is risk online just like in real life, but learn, trust that and teach them how to manage that risk. Yes, you know? definitely, so, definitely. so big things going forward. I mean, I've been thrilled to have your involvement. So, well, you know, this is just the beginning of the process for yeah. us. It's the beginning of the journey. You know, I've got yeah. a bus full of, of young students there who... who were incredibly enthusiastic from, from Monday Sorry, and Swansea and couldn't shut them up on the way back in the bus and I was four hours <laughs> with them now where you know they're so happy and confident you know, that they've seen me in a different light in, in yeah. the sense of working with this and you know, Fantastic. They're, they're I, I and we hope you know they're asking me what can we do with this can we can we present it to more groups and, you, and, and I think you are going, you going to be getting quite a few invitations so the website is digital youth wheels um, dot ning dot com mm -hmm. and that's where all the video will be archived yeah, yeah. and I've already got people talking that there was a huge buzz around the drama and how mm -hmm. inspiring it was and how lovely it was so I think watch this space you're going to get lots of uh, you know it, further work from this you know so yeah. well as I said if it gives the young, young people an opportunity to voice yeah. their views, their opinions and what they're enthusiastic about. Yeah. Then we're engaging learners and that's totally. that's the key to this, you know, yeah. because it's e learning is the future. You know, Absolutely. And as as a practitioner within the school, I've learned a tremendous amount. It's changed my views and attitudes to yeah. things and yeah. in terms of how to support, how to guide, yeah. but also how to move things forward and make sure Absolutely. that it's it's actually central to the learning agenda because, Wonderful. as I said, if we don't, we won't be preparing for the future and we'd be doing them a disservice. We'd be doing them a disservice. Yeah. Wonderful note to end on. David Hughes, thank you so much. Thank you ever so much. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah.